Hey everyone, welcome back. So today I've come to a water park in Egypt and it's fair to say there aren't that many water parks here in Sharm El Sheikh. Not that a standalone business is anyway. I'm here to visit Clio Park, which hasn't been open for the past couple of days, which I've tried to get in. They've said they've had no electricity. Apparently they have today, and I think I might have the water park all to myself because I don't think there's anybody here. Let's go see what it's like, come on. I don't think this place is open for food. <laughs> I don't think the lazy river is open. Lovely, thank you. Well, I'm in and it is very quiet. There is some music playing. I can hear the odd person but this is gonna be interesting to go to a water park where literally it's just me to go on all the slides that I want. Brilliant. So I'm in and it cost me $20 to get in, even though there's no one else around. And I've also got lockers. They cost me 20 Egyptian. I know, dollars and Egyptian. It gets all very confusing. It's gonna take a look. I mean, you can tell the age of the place because in parts it's falling down. Let's see what these look like. Lockers have all got padlocks on. Still looks reasonably clean. Just doesn't look like it's been used in a while. I'm locker number 47. Needle in a haystack. Be somewhere around here. Here it is, 47. And it's the only one that is unlocked because every other one Everywhere is locked. I'm being such the tourist with my <laughs> Egyptian bag. Out into the heat. The music's gone quiet. I'm sure I heard them say that they're actually closed for lunch at one o'clock for an hour. Wow, I've been to a water park where that happens. Not quite sure if every single ride is open. Let's have a quick look at the map. There's quite a few rides in here. Obviously we'll go on a few rides. Is this open? Is this one working? Let's have a look. Queen's Trophy. Yeah, I don't think I want to go down that. I remember you used to sit on a toboggan on this slide. You'd go down quite fast. Cleopatra there getting shaded. There is a handful of people in here actually. This is called Solar Boat. I take it if you have heart problems, you shouldn't be going on this ride. Look at the paint on it though, look. It's peeling away badly. My God, actually looks a little bit rotten. Okay, that wood does look very rotten indeed. Quickly look over the edge. Okay. Are ready? Yeah. One, two, let's go. Ah! Whoa! That was alright. So this is open. <laughs> Brilliant. Can't use these ones because the, uh, the paint has come off, but we can use this one then at least. Here we go. 
Wow, very slow. A little bit faster. It's the best day ever! Of course I'm kidding. The theming is brilliant though. A huge scorpion. This is all in a shape of a pyramid. The Egyptian hieroglyphs. It's fair to say there is plenty of sunbeds. I see a few people. This doesn't look too bad. <laughs> Pretty fast. I don't think this place is open for food. Well, the tables are set, but nothing here. Or is there someone here? No one's here. No food. I guess you could get pizza here. Or the lazy river you know what I don't think the lazy river is open and I don't think it's going to be open for some while Wow <laughs> so the floor was once what blue and the paints all been burnt away by the sun I don't know when it when it wasn't open but that doesn't look that great does it <laughs> can you see the color of the slide that does not look inviting I don't think I'll be bringing Casper here plenty of sunbeds though took a bar or was a bar Some showers. They did do entertainment once upon a time. And quite interesting is that they had little water cannons here, so whoever was on the stage, you could squirt them. They could squirt you back. One random little slide there. A couple of people are on that. It's crazy that no one is stopping me from literally just walking in here. Which I don't think I should be. But this has not been open for a very long time. It is a shame that he didn't tell me that a lot of the rides and flumes are, well, not just closed, but abandoned. Casually having a walk in the uh, in the rapids. At least they're cutting the bushes, even if they just leave it all on the floor. There are a handful of rides open. I think this was the uh, entrance to the rapids, wasn't it? As you can probably see from my face, I'm absolutely sweating. So there's about four rides open, which has cost me 15 pounds to get in. I thought I'd check out the wave pool, and I don't think the wave pool's working. No? It's very quiet though. Well, at least they've got music playing, otherwise I'm sure it would be uh, a little bit dull. 
So I think this is the only restaurant that is open. Bear in mind they were trying to sell me um, a pizza and a drink for twenty dollars. I'm like, yikes! From what I can remember, the uh, the restaurant was here. So let's have a look. Let's go. Well, can we go in? No, we can't even go in. It's locked. Wow. So they were trying to get me to go for a pizza and a, a Coke in a restaurant that is not actually open. Brilliant. Do you reckon I could ask for a refund? I used to come here 10, 15 years ago. It's really sad to see what the pandemic and other factors have caused the demise of this once great water park. If you want to see more water parks around the world, there's Siam Park in Tenerife, which is voted the best rated water park in the world. Or there's the record breaking water park in Dubai, which is here. Do give the video a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, it really does help me out. Please make sure you hit that subscribe button. I'll see you next time.